Be sure to share, like, subscribe, and comment now below. And if you'd like to get my videos every single day, make sure you turn on notifications by clicking that bell icon. Democrat congressman calls for Fox News to fire Sean Hannity. Now, as the media can constantly foams at the mouth screaming about how President Trump is a threat to the media, a Democratic lawmaker is now directly calling for Fox News to fire Sean Hannity. Representative Jerry Connolly, during an appearance on CNN on Monday, said he has called for Hannity to be fired for being represented by Michael Cohen and for reporting on things that he does not like. I don't know if that's true, but I do know that today's announcement that Sean Hannity was the third client, to me, deserves a lot of attention. Uh, you know, uh, Sean Hannity has been among the lowest of the low, wrestling in the mud of birther conspiracies, uh, Seth Rich conspiracies about the young man who tragically was murdered here in Washington, that maybe that was a different kind of murder. Uh, all kinds of conspiracy theories about Hillary Clinton, distributing false and fake news, left and right. And now what we learn is, as he's defending the president's lawyer on television, he has a conflict of interest, an ethical conflict of interest. He is one of those clients. He never revealed that. And I think that's a big stain on certainly Mr. Hannity, but also Fox News. So what do you, what do you think Fox News should do? I think they ought to fire Sean Hannity. Uh, I, I think he's, he is so into this, like a pig in the mud, he can't get out of it. And uh, I think he deserves to be fired. He cannot, his word can never again be trusted, given the fact that he consciously did not reveal this relationship. Even if there was no money exchanged between himself and Michael Cohen, he said he got, he got some advice. And then in this tweet he just posted, he said it was on real estate matters. Yeah, I heard, I heard the clip uh, you played. Uh, well, but, but he then invoked the phrase client attorney privilege. You can't have it both ways. If you're not a client, then you're not entitled to client attorney privilege. If you have it, be sure to share, like, subscribe, and comment down below. And tell me how you feel about this report. But other than that, I hope you guys have a great day. Let's make America great again. Peace.